Hey, what's going on guys? Dan with Barrel Blades and Barbells. Um, just wanted to do a follow-up on something that I uh, have been playing with, uh, the Recover Tactical 2020. Um, normally, if you if you follow my Instagram, uh, you probably have seen this hanging on my wall, on my, my uh, peg lock wall. Um, but uh, I'm actually going to be taking it out, um, not because I don't like it, but because it's getting to be fall, winter time, and I want to be able to carry, appendix carry my, my Glock 19. So with that being said, I can't really keep it in here all the time. Now I will say it is super easy to take this thing out. Um, if you watched my other video or if you didn't go watch it, um, hit the, the like and subscribe and all that crap on there. But uh, if you can see it, there's one screw right there and Make sure you have this folded in the folded position. When you take that screw out, this whole thing will just hinge open and you can take the Glock right out. Now, while that's not a big deal, um, sometimes you're in a hurry, you just want to grab the grab your firearm, stick it in your uh, holster and roll. So I'm going to be taking it out of here. If I need to put it back in, it's super easy to do that. But uh, yeah, there's this thing is freaking badass. If you guys haven't checked them out, go check out Recover Tactical. I freaking love this thing. Um, one thing I did do... Um, is that screw i went into my toolbox and i found me a little wrench that fits that it's if you're like me you put stuff together you pick up tools from whatever the heck my wife bought that i have to put together so this just happened to be a trash little wrench that i had and i i actually stuck the top of it in the velcro and it actually comes with this little uh, rubber band thing here i just kind of secured it with that hasn't fallen out yet so for now it's going to stay in there till it falls out and if it falls out it falls out no big deal but uh that's that the other thing is is winter time like i was saying want to be able to appendix carry i'm gonna slide this down just to touch so you guys can see what i'm talking about but appendix carry um glock 19 i do have an extended mag on this right now which without the mag you can't even really like i'm not a big dude like i'm about 200 pounds is 6'3", so I'm not really a huge guy, and this is a medium shirt. So if I had a large on, a little less pull around the, the shoulders and waist, it would clear no problem. So I've got extended mag and my standard uh, um, backup mag over here, and this is my uh, appendix carry from North Coast Tactical. Uh, you can see this is flexi here so it allows you to uh, have some room and if you're one of those people that you're like hey I don't want to carry this all the time you can actually undo this knot this comes off you don't have to have it all the time and I believe Dan has another one that has a different mount for this I'm, uh, don't quote me on that but I, I thought I seen he had one the other day but uh, it's already got the holes right here so you can take this off mount that and you can uh, side holster it so yeah Go check out uh, Dan over at North Coast Tactical. Uh, I freaking love his stuff. As you can see, he customizes colors, patterns, um, even the uh, the different holster hooks, stuff like that. He makes AR-15 mag holders, AR-10 mag holders. You're welcome because I give him my uh, AR-10 to mold with. So um, AR-10 and pistol Glock. Uh, I'm not even sure what all he has. I think he does some Smith stuff and some Sig stuff as well. And if it's one of those things that you have something that's like obscure, you can actually go to him if you're in Ohio, obviously, but uh, or close, you can uh, go to him and he'll custom make you whatever the heck you want. So go check out North Coast Tactical. Um, and uh, yeah, you guys uh, stay tactical and I'll see you next time.